Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So today, we're going to be feeding a few of my animals. So to start off the batch, we're going to start with my Cribbon of Versicolor, Tori. She has molted out, and if I can, I'm going to insert a photo right here. Her adult colors are starting to come in with that green carapace and that red butt. Um, um, but she's a juvenile, um, but I'm super stoked that her adult colors are coming out. So you can see her right here. Um, she's actually out and about, which I think means she wants food. And can we just get how big she has gotten? Um, there are hard water stains on here. I'm spraying her um, after, we, after we do this video because I need visual content, okay? So she has been quite flighty lately. And... Um, mainly when I spray her, she's been quite flighty. I haven't opened the enclosure yet because her water's been fine and she hasn't really been needing any maintenance. So let's hope she does well. Let's hope she doesn't speak. I'm like tapping the top to like make sure we're not going to get a huge reaction. I find it easier to feed her from the floor. Um, I just have more control. And we're going to be feeding her one of these. We're going to be offering one of these wax worms. And if she doesn't end up taking it for us on camera, I'll just leave it in her web. And if she will end up taking it from there. Let's get y'all a front row view. Hopefully she'll eat for us again on camera. I think it's quite cool to see it. However, I only have one, so I can't really do a trash the feeding video. Because if I do, and they don't eat, then the video is over. <laughs> so let's see what happens. Okay, no reaction. I opened it. She's gonna go out of frame for a second. I wanna know where her head is. Okay, so her head is over here. It's like over here, and then that's her butt over there. I'm not gonna lie, kinda nervous. I don't have the catch cup on me. Probably a dumb idea. But we have some fresh wax work. Get back here. She dropped the back for him. I'm very bad at this. Okay, I don't think she's gonna take it and I don't wanna push her. So I'm just gonna go ahead and leave it right here for her on her little cork. Um, as you can probably tell, I'm quite nervous about her right now because lately she's been very, very flighty. So I'm gonna go ahead and put her back up on her shelf and I'll show you like where I put the worm and where she is and all that. So she did move a little bit. I will say, so, here she is in all of her glory, and her meal is right there, like, on the cork bark. You can kind of see it, it's like a little tan butt. Um, I don't want to push her, she's right up next to the top of the lid. Um, yeah, she does definitely make me a little nervous um, right now, because she is quite flighty, and I will demonstrate what I mean right now. Go ahead and spray her down. Wow. You're in a good mood today? You were so mad, like, for the past, like, three days. I'm like, she's been very flighty, blah, blah, blah. Way to show me wrong, Tori, thanks. Made me look like a liar. Like, for real, I would spray her down, she'd be out, and I'll spray her, she'll run. But I can't really see her anymore. But I'm surprised she didn't flinch. Really. Thanks for the, um, thanks for the suspense, Tori. I really appreciate this great video content you're giving me. We'll probably check up on her later, um, when we're done with this video and see if she's eaten. That's 
what City is about. Okay, I really don't like showing y'all this fish tank because it's honestly not my favorite and I'm not really doing it right. I do have future projects coming up to improve my fish care husbandry, but it is a work in progress and I have to wait for some things to get approved by my very loving, loving parent called my mom. So right now I'm just looking for our culprit for today. Um, the fish are too shy to eat anything, especially the size of a wax worm. But where is he? Oh my gosh, he's usually always in this Amazon sort, and he's not right now. Because of course, why wouldn't he be right when I try to film a video? Okay. Well, thanks. Thanks, Eagle. I'm going to find this frog, and then <laughs> I will pick up my camera. Okay, so I'm going to subscribe to Martin 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 Martin
counting on you. I think this video is exciting. Okay, so we're gonna pour about three, four cups of pellets. Can you make sure that I meant to one eighth of a cup with a good amount? I double it personally because not all the time they get veggies um, because sometimes we just can't get veggies. But I am trying to grow some. I'm doing very well. I did some harvests yesterday, and so we're getting a little bit more veggie income. But it's still in the work in progress. Hello, he's a senior. Oh, and there he goes. Oh, and now he comes. Hello, baby. Hi. He is quite old. He's about five or six years old. And it's just so much better when you get hen and fed pellets, right? Um, I did order some Optical Natural Science um, from um, Joint Support and Multivitamins to make sure he's getting enough supplements. Frankie will also probably get the multivitamins because she um, is lowest ranking out of their hierarchy, so those will get first tips on the food. So make sure she's getting the right amount of vitamins, she's getting some of the multivitamins as well, and she's her being at the top, she I know her vitamins are perfectly okay. Do you want another one, baby? You go fuzzy. Okay, you If you want um a meet, meet my pet um on any of these guinea pigs, one of the three, let me know and that could be a future video. I do keep a fan on them. It blows like on the plastic part, so if they get too hot on their fleas, they can kinda cool down on top of the plastic. Which I have seen them do. And it also helps them to like the air and make it less stinky. Come on, those air purifiers. Do you like some for me? Come back around, eating ones with little treats in them. But we had just run out and we needed. Well, this is all they had on them, so we bought it. But usually we use the plain ones. So that's been eliminated. I don't want to go through the head because that's messy and I don't want to. It's just hard. The pellets were a little bit more interesting. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed, please hit the like button and subscribe. Leave a comment down below on anything you think I should do as a future video, any ideas. I'm open to anything. If you have any questions for me or for others, leave it down below and maybe we can help you out. Thank you so much for watching today's video and I'll see y'all in the next video.